happy day, I'm glad. And this is Brinky. You guys haven't seen Brinky in a while, so I thought I'd bring him for the intro today. Today we are trying experiments from TikTok that I have never seen before. I'm excited, it's gonna be a good one. Hey, are you okay? I feel the power of a thousand stars inside me. Oh, this little guy, what a mess. <gasps> Ooh, oh, that's nice. That's real nice. Oh, okay. I mean, I actually have seen this one before, <laughs> but I want to try it anyway. I don't think Terry knew that I had seen this before, but it's a good one. Melting the crayons and pouring it in water and then having like this, this little display. Like imagine if it looks really cool and you can just like put a crayon thing on your dresser and people can be like, mm, she likes the fine art. She understands the art. Unfortunately, our crayons aren't kind of like in that cool pattern like that because oh are they just in a stack yeah they're just in a stack we ain't got the time for that we're gonna mix together anyways you're upsetting the dog he's always upset no he's not i can never make him happy okay let's give it a go look at this this is the most cooking i've done this year gorgeous look at that so many different colors Ooh. Ooh. look at that rainbow drip Ooh. as they say in my home country. Here it comes. Woo. Wee woo 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 woo. That's so cool. It looks like an underwater like. A coral reef. Yeah, it looks like a coral reef. It also looks like a poop. You put an Alka-Seltzer tablet in it too. Oh my goodness. Should I? No, it's not gonna do anything. <laughs> It'll look cool though. Okay, fine. Like pick it up and then drop this on the bottom and then drop it. Okay. Oh, this this made the water really hot. Okay, it's oh, okay, it's way too hot. There's an opening here. Ah, yeah. How does it look? Now it looks like an aquarium. Does it? Yeah. I love when people make, especially on TikTok, when people make like the terrariums, like but the fake ones. And this kind of is like giving me that vibe. It's kind of got like a weird kind of like sewage terrarium. Can yeah, don't it? pour boiling crayon into water and then reach in with your hand. That's very much like something I would do for an experiment and it's just not smart. I thought it would have cooled down like much quicker. Yeah, it looked too, like it was. Because it was really cold water, but like, yeah, that <laughs> kind of burns. <laughs> Should we just display this? Call what? it like the cursed grapes. Why does it look? Uh, kind of good. <laughs> you could do this in water if you're like, if you can do it more controlled and you could like make a little figurine. Ooh. Ooh. Ladies and gentlemen, the newest addition to my art wall. <laughs> oh, oops, not very good. Me trying to jump without bending my knees. Trying to jump without bending your knees. That sounds easy enough. Okay, let's go. I'm pretty sure you bent them, girl. I'm pretty sure she bent them. Okay, this is dangerous. Okay, that's too dangerous. <laughs> oh, you can see my feet from here. Okay, my knees are locked. Oh, you can just... If you don't bend your knees, you can jump by just lift... You can just bend your feet. Easy. Got him. Got him. Got him. Why are you just standing there? He's just standing there looking at me. Did you like that? I think you did. Allison. Okay, Allison. so this is the girl falling with wall trick. Put your left are you sure? The wall. Put your left leg against the wall. Pick your right foot up. Oh. oh. You want to be my wall? Okay, I have to have my leg fully against you. I can't. I actually can't, it's impossible. If I'm fully against you, unless I go like this a little bit, that it has to be against the wall. Okay. I can't. I can't! It's impossible. You learn something new every day. Oh, uh, there you go. Well, obviously. This is called the wine lava lamp. Oil in a glass. Water. Those two don't mix. And is this food coloring? Okay, cool. Wait, what's the third thing he put in? Oh, it's Alka-Seltzer. Alka-Seltzer. What's that? I think it's supposed to help your stomach. Okay, okay, so like Tums. Oh, <gasps> cool! I love it. Oh my God, it's getting crazier. Oil, water, food coloring, Alka-Seltzer. Look how curious Brinky is. Are you curious, Brink? He's very curious. Actually, we're gonna do the, no, we're gonna do the oil first. Water, oil, oil. 
vegetable oil. An oil that I don't normally keep in my house. Okay, this is so oiled up that I can't get it open. <laughs> I need help. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I don't need help. I'm a grown woman. I can you do what I want. It. I'm a grown woman. I can do whatever I want. Lots of oil. Lots of oil. Yeah, listen to it. It's, not, it's like ASMR. We're gonna have some bubbles. We're gonna have some water. This is gonna love going down my toilet after this. After I drink it. I'm just kidding. Okay, I'm gonna just put like... Okay, now we have to wait for them to like kind of separate. Do you think we need more... <laughs> Do you think we need more water? <laughs> what? You just look hilarious. Okay, that, that definitely has to be good. Wow! It looks cool. Do you remember how much food coloring I put? Uh. For our little experiment, we're gonna use blue. Did you guys have lava lamps when you were growing up? My lava lamp was like one of my most prized possessions. Like I loved it so much. Look at that. Mm. Ooh. Wow. Can we do red too? It might make it kind of dark. Kind of murky. It might make purple though. I think we gotta do red too. Look at the little balls. They're like uh, bubble tea. Yeah, it's like boba. Wow. This is the greatest thing I ever done. Is that enough, do you think? Yeah, probably. You sure? Okay, I gotta put more. Okay, stop. Okay, fine. Now it's time for our Alka-Seltzer. Now, I'm not that dumb, but I didn't know what this was, but it's because I do not get acid reflux. I just don't, I don't know why, I'm really lucky. All right, here we go. Oh. Oh, cool. Okay, some of the balls are like joining together and there's like big balls and small balls and like a lot of the red, it's mixing into purple. Whoa. So I feel like I did something wrong because it's not joining into like big lavas. You know what I mean? And I don't want to do it again because I don't want to waste oil. I've done enough. <laughs> <laughs> Should I put more Alka-Seltzer and just see what happens? Probably. Okay. Here we go. Okay, let's go. One, two, three. Oh boy. Uh-oh. <laughs> do we make a mistake? I think it's good. I, I was like, if it's going to rise more, then I got to run. But it looks like it's just going to make a mess within the tube. It's so funny because it's like an experiment for kids and like it's funny how even I could mess up an experiment for kids. That said, it's really cool. So if you add too much, it just becomes some kind of witch's brew. Yeah, it's very Halloween-y. The weird thing about this is that it's like edible. Like you could drink this. That's true. But I won't. It probably wouldn't be very good. No, it'd be horrendous. I'm sorry guys, I got greedy and I want it to work. I feel like the oil that I originally saw was like canola because I don't remember being at this yellow. I'm using a wine glass because it's easier for me to like eyeball, yeah. Okay, this is a conservative run. It worked. It actually worked this time. Still really messy, yes, but I think that the part at the bottom where everything meets makes it a lot more like centralized and allows the food coloring to get into bigger chunks. It also makes it go up through the middle instead of the Yeah, sides. very cool. Maybe last time there was too much water. Oh. You know what this is, Terry? Hmm. Chemical reaction. Oh wait, is it? I mean, the Alka-Seltzer is. But it's not creating heat. That's a thermal reaction. Okay, I'm out. Girl push-ups? Those aren't girl push-ups. That's how, okay. No. Okay, no. Terry, are you out of your mind? I'm gonna get hurt. I can spot you. No, if I don't land it, I'm gonna be so winded. But what I can do is I can do a back bridge and then try to do push-ups in the back bridge. You ready? Yep. Okay. <laughs> oh God, I haven't done one of these in years. Whoa, she can do it. My hands on my hair. Oh, it's hard. You're alive. It's like not that hard though. It would have been if I did the the <laughs> actual. Did, did the flip? Okay, so like a lot of these are like water. This is like water TikTok. So you put balloons in a cup, and then oh, 
Oh, that is cool too. Oh. Oh, we're gonna have to get our slow mo on. Wow. Oh, I can do that. I don't really have like a pointy syringe thing though. Do we have a needle? Probably not in this house. Okay, so the blender is the biggest thing that we had left and I'm afraid that the blades at the bottom are going to pop the balloon. So I'm gonna do it very, very slowly. And by the way, I'm poking with a dart taped to a chopstick. We're getting a little uh, creative here. Oh, I didn't know that would float. Yeah, there's a little bit of air in the balloons. Okay. Cool. I'm gonna go for the blue one first. Whoops. I think that it needs to be like a more fine tip than what I have. Oh my. Oh. Whoop. Oh, it's gonna spill. Oh. Okay. We got this. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Why is this going so wrong? Oh. oh <laughs> into the black. We're gonna have to watch that in slow mo and see what happened. Uh, hopefully it's good. <laughs> What do we got here? Please, work out. Let's go. She's pressing it in. She's wondering why it hasn't popped yet. Oh. So cool. <laughs> How do I work so hard and mess up everything I do? So, unlucky. But you know what you can't mess up? Things being vacuumed. I don't know why, I just find this, okay, I would never do this to my vacuum. That's a lot of stuff going in your vacuum. A banana? No! Ah, oh, flower. Okay, that's an easy that's an easy and safe choice. But probably the worst for your vacuum, to be honest. Really? Yeah. But isn't doesn't dust go in there? Um, okay, what are we roombaing? <laughs> paper shreds. We've shed a lot of paper in our lives. Danky. Is this gonna damage the Roomba? I don't think so. See if we can make a clean line. Yes. Clean line. Come on, little buddy, I believe in you. Oh. My. <laughs> Satisfying? No. Uh, this is horrendous. Look at all that stuck paper. And there's hair too. Well, he's gonna have to work for a while now because I'm not cleaning that up. Yeah, I'm not cleaning this either. Okay, here we go. I think that it, like, it should have been like spread really thin. Yeah, we're giving him a hard job. He's running away. You can't run. There's a chair. This actually hurts to watch, I can't. <laughs> we should have got the 4x4. Four four. I actually feel bad for the Roomba. It's like so much garbage. Look at his little body, this is more than he can take. We're gonna have to clean this ourselves. Dang it! Alright, Cassie thinks this is gonna be more manageable. Yeah, and we actually can't get this, so... We're screwed. This, yeah, nope, this isn't it. We're gonna have to get a new rug. Yeah, we're gonna have to get a new house. I didn't know this was a vacuuming video. Shouldn't have been. Well, that was, uh, you know, gloom trying <laughs> to do satisfying experiments. I mean, some of them went well, some of them did not. None of them turned out the way that the TikToks did. Is it false advertising or am I just an idiot? I think I'm just an idiot. I hope you guys enjoyed this video though. If you'd like to see me again, make sure you hit push notifications and I will see you on the next one. Bye.